Hey, kindergarten. We are on day three of our favorite apple foods. So we are gonna do some writing today. I'm holding my pencil correctly. I remember yesterday I wrote about apple cake, this piece of cake, and a plate. So now I need to add some words down here. Now, I would like to write, I like apple cake. Let's go ahead and count how many words are in that sentence. I like apple cake. How many words? There are four words. So we have a plan. I need to write, I like apple cake. So I'm gonna start with the first part of the sentence. The first part is I, and last week our sight word was I, and I know how to write I. We always use a capital letter to write I. This week, our sight word is like. So check it out. I'm gonna make sure I spell it correctly because it is a sight word that we know. I like, do you notice that there's a space right here? That's called a finger space. That's how we know that we are done with the first word and we're moving on to the next. So I'm actually gonna use a finger space for the next word too. I like apple cake. So next word is apple. Oh, I already wrote it up here. I know how to spell it. Apple. Uh-oh, I think I might run out of space here. I don't want to run out of space, so I'm going to go to the next line. I like apple cake. And I remember that I already wrote cake up here. I like apple cake. So I think I'm pretty good. Let me go ahead and read the sentence back and then we'll count the words. I like apple cake. One, two, three, four. Our plan said that we needed four words. We have four words. We did pretty well. So if I were to read this, like if I were saying it on Seesaw, for example, I would not say I like apple cake because it is the best kind of cake in the world and it's my favorite thing to eat that has apples in it. The sentence I said out loud has way more than four words in it. When we read, we need to read exactly the words that are on the page. We're not gonna make it up. We wanna read what the author said. In this case, you are the author and your words are on the page so we can read those. So check this out. I like apple cake. If we get to a word we don't know, like if somebody else was trying to read this word and they weren't sure what it was, they might be able to sound it out by saying the sounds that they see. So if that person were reading and they said, k -k, all right, we know it starts with a k. Hmm. I like apple k. Well, that's hard. Then they can look to the next word or the next letter. And in this case, it's an A. A is a special kind of letter. It has two sounds. It's a vowel. So A says A ah, and A says A. So they might go K, A. Ah. I like apple ca. Well, that doesn't help. Hmm. Okay, let's look at the picture to check. Well, this is definitely not a ca, and it's not a cat either. Now let's try the other vowel sound. We'll use our flippy dolphin skill. And this definitely isn't a ca, so maybe it's a cake. Oh, it's a cake. Apple cake. I like apple cake. Nice. There is our day three. Tomorrow we will edit and revise. See you then.